Hi Cancers, thank you for viewing Searchlight Tarot. My name is Elena. I am doing a general spread for you. I'm going to look at something you've recently been through. If it sounds like your situation, this is your reading. This is a general reading. It is good for all placements for the sign of Cancer and energies can be moved around. But right now I'm going to get one or two cards to start the reading out for the strongest energy around you. Hey Spirit Guides, one or two cards for the sign of Cancers. For the strongest energy, please, that this reading is for. For the sign of Cancers. One or two cards, please, for the sign of Cancers. Strongest energy around the sign, thank you, of Cancers. Any other cards? Thank you. Okay. I got throat chakra and I got truth. Oh, you know, uh, the throat chakra is all about truth. Saying what you got to say, opening it up so you can speak with truth. That's the strongest energy around you right now. If it feels like, uh, I'm going to look at something you've recently been through, but I felt that, I think I did your last reading, I, I do feel it's something about open communication needs to be had. You know, whether it's with somebody new, a little confusion going on, we've had a Venus and a Mercury retrograde, now we're rolling into a full-blown one. You know, maybe some something just needs to be spoken here. Maybe with a new person, somebody from the past, I don't know, but let's find out. Okay, Spirit Guides, for the sign of Cancers, something they've recently gone through. Hmm. What do you want to show me for the sign of Cancers that this reading is for? Thank you. Something they've recently gone through for the sign of Cancers. Thank you. Thank you. Anything else? Anything else you want to show me? Thank you. Oh, well. For the sign of Cancers. Thank you. Anything else? I'm not done. Hmm. Okay, the bottom of the deck starts the reading for me, Cancers. I have the Seven of Swords with the Five of Cups. I got a Three of Cups showing up. And then I have the Nine of Swords. Nine of Swords is just a nightmare card to me. With the Seven of Swords, that's about deceptive behavior. Whether it was you or the other person, I haven't looked into their energies yet, but somebody tried to get away with something and that's left you really sad about some spilt cups of love here you know and with the nine of swords here that whole situation recently just turned into a complete to me this is you know just something that still gnaws on your brain at night i have the three of cups that is the tree of love, tree of life, but it's also third party i'm kind of feeling something here i'm not sure yet because i have throat chakra and truth all right, what else do we have here? Okay, I have the Ace of Cups with the star. It was a new opportunity of love, or it felt like a new beginning of a new opportunity of love. The star is Aquarian energy about um, hope and faith, healing from it. I have the Two of Wands trying to move forward from a broken heart. And then I have you showing up, Cancer's Chariot. I only looked because I felt it. You know, I just felt something. And then I have transformation with going off in a new direction. But, and then I have the King of Swords under that. Truth. All right, what do we have over here? I have the Ten of Cups with the Two of Cups in the recent past. That's a whole lot of happiness that you felt with a love connection. That you felt with a love connection. There was someone that made you feel really happy. Don't tell me it wasn't, but I have Justice in Verse. Justice in reverse, uh, Libra energy, but that's about uh, truth was not spoken. The scales were not balanced. This was an unvary, this was, this situation was very unbalanced is what I feel. I have the page pentacles with the nine of pentacles in reverse, earth energy. The page of pentacles is, uh, you tried to start something with a little stability here. You tried to offer just a little bit. And with the nine of pentacles in reverse, it. Either somebody tried to offer you, but I feel you did. And with the Knight of Pentacles in reverse, nothing came to that 
of that situation. I mean, the Nine of Pentacles upright is about mastering something. I have the uh, Ace of Pentacles, a new solid opportunity, and I have, boy, are you eager to get that started. You know, I mean, the Page of Wands is very eager, immature fire energy. And I feel that you're thinking about or hoping for a new golden opportunity. Is it with somebody from the past, somebody in the future? I don't know, but this is something you've recently been through. You still think about that. And I have truth with throat chakra. Come on. All right, spirit guides. Tell me about the opposing energies my Cancerians have been dealing with. If you are not dealing with anyone, there's a timestamp to come into the incoming energies in the description box. The opposing energies, please. For the sign of cancer, show me about the crossing energies. What do you want to show me about the opposing energies for the sign of cancers? Thank you. Show me what I need to see about the crossing energies that cancers have been dealing with. Thank you. <laughs> what else do you want to show me? Thank you. Anything else about the crossing energies? No, they're done. I can always tell when they're done because they get... Well, the crossing energies, I have the Queen of Pentacles. Oh, my goodness. The Queen of Earth. Your crossing energies is someone who has achieved their self-worth holding on to something very grounded and stable about themselves because this queen fought very hard to get here and underneath that i have cancer showing up with the combat zone the five of wands um chariot with the queen of pentacles in the combat zone right there yeah you're right here in this person's energy i feel like they're literally like thinking about it thinking about the conflicts you know, but they're holding on to something very earthy about themselves. I have the, I have the two of wands popping out in the left over here. To me, this is about a place of, they know they have to move forward. They know it's time for them to move forward, but they're stalled out because the past is weighing on them. I have the 10 of cups and then I have it with the seven of swords in reverse. Ten of Cups, uh, you had the Seven of Swords under your deck. Seven of Swords in reverse is somebody who just feels like this happiness is something that they're, ti they're tired of being deceived about. That's what I feel. That's what I feel. You know, um, I do have the Seven of Wands here. This is someone who's standing their ground battling at whatever comes towards them and i have it with the page of swords the page of swords is air energy but it's about the page i feel who still thinks about you because you showed up in their energies you're right here with that solitary queen i can't make these cards up right there in the combat zone with the two of wands they they want to move forward but even though they're standing their ground they can't stop thinking about you because when I put the Page of Swords down, it's staring at your energies. And then over here, I have the Page of Wands with you. You know, they're both kind of looking at each other the way I'm looking at them. Really. Like, this is <clears throat> your side and this is their side. They're, like, looking at each other. Like, I still think about you and I still feel for you. I want to get something new started. And whether it's with you or somebody else, I don't know. But some truth needs to be said here. <laughs> you guys are okay. All right. If it's not your reading, it's not your reading. But let's move into the incoming. Spirit guides, the incoming energies for the sign of cancer. All right, spirit guides, tell me about the incoming energies in the next few weeks. What do you want to show me for the incoming energies? Thank you. One more card for the sign of cancers. One more card. Oh, they gave me three more cards. All right, Cancers. Let's see what they have to say. Just got to put my readers on. I have all that glitters. Go. Oh, my God. I thought it said go to the sea. All that glitters, to be fair, imagine 
Is this one about speaking the truth? <laughs> Pretty much clean it up. Come on, Cancers. Incoming energies. It's something that it's something that you feel is beautiful. All that glitters, but you know all that glitters sometimes isn't as beautiful as it may appear. I have to be fair, and I feel that it I just kind of feel like there's something that needs to be spoken with truth on both sides. You know, I don't know what it is. I just kind of feel like a game going on here. And then I have imagine, you know, it's something you think about all the time in the incoming energies. You're going to be having a lot of nostalgia because we have Mercury retrograde coming in. And I have clean it up. That's what my spirit guides want me to tell you. I have throat chakra with truth in your current energies. All right. I'm done yelling. <laughs> yeah. Spirit guides. Incoming energies. For the sign of cancers, please, for the next few weeks. Show me why those cards are here. Incoming kind of guidance. What do you want to show me about the incoming energies? For the sign of cancers. What do you want to tell me, please? Incoming energies for my beautiful cancers for the next few weeks for this reading. Incoming energies. Thank you. What do you want to show me about those cards for the sign of cancer, please? Thank you. Hmm. What else do you want to tell me? Thank you. Anything else? Nope. Bottom of the deck is I have the nine of cups. That is wish fulfillment with the king of water. Something you feel deeply that you've been wishing for. I have the Knight of Wands with the Ten of Pentacles. Wow. And then I have the High Priestess with the Queen of Wands. And then I have the Combat card showing up with the Four of Wands. New Gateway is about to open. Ten of Pentacles is something that has brought you a lot of stability in the incoming energies. It's something that you need to go after and be, be determined to get it. That Knight of Wands doesn't bow out. That, that Ten of Pentacles is something that you truly want. Because I have wish fulfillment here with the King of Love. And then under all that, I have deceptive behavior with strength and courage. Strength. Leo. I just feel, I really do feel that both sides are being deceptive with each other. And you can yell at me all you want, but I just kind of feel that. In the incoming energies, I have the moon in reverse. Well, all those things that have been hidden from you are about to be revealed. <laughs> I have it with the Ten of Swords. It's something that's been over. I got the Two of Pentacles going back and forth with the Six of Wands, the Victory card. And I have justice. The truth to be spoken. Let's balance these scales. Six of Wands. It's a victory card but with the two of pentacles here it's about going back and forth back and forth back and forth about something you know to do with your stability i feel it's about your happiness the ten of swords is a card of a completion that i feel that everything that you feel has been completed and hidden from you because you don't understand why because you have justice in reverse over here the final outcome is justice throat chakra clean it up imagine you know and to be fair and that's what this card is all about to be fair from the things that have been hidden I just feel that there's some I don't mean deceptive behavior like you know oh, I, I just feel like there's a miscommunication here I don't know why I feel that I just feel some openness and some truth on both parties if you're done with them and maybe it's somebody new, you know, maybe there's somebody you like. Maybe you should be open and honest with them. I don't know. All right, Spirit Guides. One or two beautiful messages about the reading for the sign of Cancers. Mm. Mm. Hold on, Cancers. One more shuffle. For the sign of Cancers, please. One or two messages. Thank you. All right, Spirit Guides. What do you want to tell me so I can tell cancers what kind of spiritual messages, one or two cards for the sign of cancer, please. One more card. Thank you. Ooh, I guess Angel Michael has something he, they really want to tell you, and I think you should listen. 
I first have the three of Michael. Mm -hmm. Release the past. You will grow from this situation. Time heals all wounds. Whatever happened in the past is the past. But I still think communication needs to be had. There it is right there. The king. The king of air himself. The king of Michael. Wisdom and objectivity are important now. Stay in your integrity. A situation that calls for honest and open communication. I can't make that up, Cancers. We started, you know. I mean, I really felt something here. Um, throat chakra. Truth. Clean it up. That's what I have for you. If it resonated and you enjoyed it, please remember to like, leave a comment, subscribe if you're not. Thank you, Cancers, for supporting my channel. Many blessings to everyone and have a beautiful day. Thank you.